Wednesday. How are you doing today? I hope you're doing fantastic. Today, we are going to be reading a new story called Friends in the Stars. Now, boys and girls, every day we know that we have a different goal. Today's goal is to use expressions on familiar refrains. So what does that mean? That means that we are going to read like we talk. So, for example, right now, I'm just talking normally, right? I'm saying sentences. I'm saying what we're going to do. But how would you talk if you were super excited? Would you talk just like this? Or would you talk like this? I'm so excited. I'm going to go to the park this weekend with my mom. And we are going to have so much fun. We're going to play some catch. We might play some soccer or football. I don't know, but I'm so, so excited. I'm talking with excitement there, right? So if I was going to write something with excitement, what could I use? I could probably use an exclamation mark, right? What if I was reading something with a question? Or what if I was asking a question? Would I talk like this? This is me asking a question. Not really, right? I would probably speak with a tone of questioning. I would say, hey, what are you doing today? Are you doing good? Are you doing any homework today? Are you playing with some friends? How are you feeling? See, those are questions. So if we were reading, what would we see to indicate that we are reading question? A question mark, right? So that's all we're doing today. When we read, let's read with some expression. So I'm going to read first and you're going to read after. You ready? Let's do this. Friends in the stars. Let's get the highlighter blue today. So I see, before I start reading, I already see a question mark right here. And I see a comma. So this is what I'm going to do. Mama dog, mama dog, what do you see? Now you. I see a period here, so this is how I'm going to read it. I see an eagle looking down at me. Now you. Excellent. So did you see the difference? Here, I asked a question. And here, I just read the statement. So here, their expression is going to be with a racing tone at the end. It's going to be rising tone. And then in the other one is going to be flat. Right? Let's keep going. Again, I see a question mark. In a period. So I know this is a question, this is a statement. Puppy dog, puppy dog, what do you see? I see a dragon breathing fire at me. Excellent. How are we going to read these two sentences on page five? Right. This is going to be a question because we see a question mark. And this is going to be a normal sentence because we see a period. A normal statement, just flat. Let's do it. Mama dog, mama dog, what do you see? I see a snake slithering quickly at me. Let's see if you can read this one. Good job. Not me. Puppy dog, puppy dog. What do you see? Did you read it just like that? If you did, that's excellent. Let's see what he sees. I see a fox hunting eagles with me. Good job. Again, we look at the picture. We know that this is mom and dog and puppy dog. And they're looking at the stars. So what do they see? They're connecting the stars. And here they're using their imagination. They see a fox and they see the eagle. Awesome. Read this one again. And then we'll read this one together.
good. Mama dog, mama dog, what do you see? I see a fair king ruling over me. Fantastic. So what are they doing again? They're just connecting the stars and this is what they're seeing. Puppy dog, puppy dog, what do you see? It's a question mark. I see a pretty queen waving at me. Excellent. They have great imaginations. Look at all of these pictures, all of these things that they're imagining just by putting the stars together. Mama dog, mama dog, what do you see? I see a white swan flying away from me. Perfect, good, good, good. Puppy dog, puppy dog, what do you see? I see a little bear making friends with me. Excellent. Good job, boys and girls, reading today. I loved how you followed those question marks and those periods and you know what you knew what to say and how to say it what tone of voice to use if you are following with me or reading on your own I'm so happy that you are doing so good and so fantastic you are becoming stronger and better readers every